So one of the problems is the question of the channel and the MIDI. So we're going to try to load some new import. Okay, we will do again some combis. Okay, so now we'll have combi here. And this is always different from the one you you load. That's the main. That's sometimes also a problem. So now if we go to the channel, we see now have two two combis. One is called combi two oasis and the other is combi. So I can load this one combi and here we have all channels and if we go to one channel we can see here that we have the patch files so here we have all kinds of patch files particles and waves well known so but if we go here or here we will not get the real we will not get the real file the real device panel so but if I go to all here then the device panel opens it depends on how the device panel is programmed if it's done in the whole file or on a special channel so we can open here see so if we open here we have three possibilities we have the patches which we can see here all kinds of patches you see here we have particles and waves so but we have also what they call the device and here we see all our different CISEX files no the modules the modules we have in our panel and when we go here treating the device then we see the device plus all informations so here if we go for instance on such uh, item we see here oasis combi karma slider 2 and if we choose the parameters here we can see karma slider 2 and the kind of CC or CISX which is used here for let's say we use this one so now it changes to comma scene one and if we see here the parameters then we see here a CISX file which has been programmed if we want another one here we want to change something here we can use something here from there or we can open here the whole paraphernalia of CISX which I have programmed or the channel channels the control changes here from the channels the different control changes you see and also special CISX file so we don't need that now we can go out if we want to check our panel by using some of these informations we have here let's say this one we want to test it we can here do okay testing now the channel should work on our instrument when we move it 
one thing is if you have not put testing on if you move it here you will move the whole thing because then it's editable the whole uh, item is editable you can move it anywhere and that is happening very often that one forgets and then afterwards one can arrange again the whole thing so this far if we cut it here if something new has been programmed it asks to if you want to save it or not so nothing has been done so it will not be saved now and we can close it so that's to give an idea about the whole complexity of panels if we want to save a panel for instance we have to go into devices and say MIDI and any kind of these devices uh, we can save now if we say export this it will export all the programs that we have here not only one if you want to have only one you have to uh, delete all the others and just keep one so one possibility is to save all and then delete three or four whatever and just save one again and then re-import the four or the three or the four you see here for instance I have combis and programs if I want to import this now no sorry that was not the right thing to do import if I want to import these programs okay so now he will ask me which of these two saves together I want. I want only the combi or I want only the program for instance. So I can choose or I can open both of it. It doesn't matter. Okay. JJ, I'm sure.